finding out more today about an incredible organization in Edmonton that makes a big difference in people's lives. We have Joshua Marshall here on behalf of the Bissell Centre, along with Grant Robinson, who can speak to the support that he has received there. So thank you both for coming in. Thank you for having us, Martin. So, talk to you about the Bissell Centre. I think a lot of people have probably heard the name, but don't really know exactly what it does. So what are some of the services offered there? Yeah, Bissell Centre is a human service organization that is within the inner city. We have 19 different programs that range from child care uh, centres to employment services and uh, a drop-in centre as well. And although it's just some of the three that I mentioned, but there are, again, about another 16 that are available for people within the inner city. Fantastic. And so, Grant, you're one of the clients there. What, what brought you to the Bissell Centre? Well, uh, I just recently got out of prison and I had Pastor Rick from the Bissell Center come and visit me and help me get my mountain bike out of the bulk storage. And uh, he told me that I could pick up the bike over at the Bissell Center on a Sunday at church. So I went there and uh, ever since I've been going back. Clever plan he had there, eh? Yes, very clever. <laughs> you got your bike and he brought you there. So what sort of difference have you found that, that it makes in your life and why do you keep going back? Um, well, I... Um, I decided to stay out of trouble. My lawyer, Naeem Ralph, uh, asked me to, you know, straighten up my life, and uh, he told me about the Bissell Center and uh, seeing how Pastor Rick's part of it. I decided to uh, follow up on it, and when I went to the Bissell Center, I had no ID. Uh, they helped me with my ID. They helped me with uh, mental uh, mental stress uh, issues and um, clothing. I got my clothes set from there, and. Uh, I had to make some appointments to go, you know, downtown, and they gave me some bus tickets, and they really helped me out. They helped me out with food and uh, all kinds of stuff. It's really nice. nice. So really practical help, as, as well as sort of the support that you need to make sure that you keep your life on the right path. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Now, you've brought some things here. This is, <laughs> this is so interesting. This is going to be part of the silent auction, and this is the special talent you've acquired. Yes. But what are these made out of? Explain us, you know, how you make this sort of stuff. Well, I really didn't know I had this talent until I was in 23-hour lockup in segregation at the Edmonton Remand Center. And what I would, uh, what I've done is, Floyd McIntosh provides you with um, art paper, and I had a pill bottle, uh, and I had a couple of pill bottles, small ones and big ones. So I got the pill bottle, I put it over the art paper, I went around it and around it with a pen because you're not allowed to have scissors in jail, obviously, and it broke through. Then I was going through the Toronto Sun and I noticed a tuxedo, a black tuxedo. So I put the pill bottle over that and uh, went around it until it broke through. And then I got my institutional toothpaste and I glued it, I glued it on. And um, I just started creating a frame and then I started with the motor. And uh, before you know it, I, I thought, all right, there's a car, there's a nice hot rod. Exactly, you've got a lot of creativity in there. Thank you. Okay, so now to support the Bissell Center, you do have, a, it's called the Bissell Liberation coming up, uh, on the twenty or on the 14th rather. Uh, that is at Sutton Place Hotel. Tell us quickly what that's all about. Yeah, it's our annual uh, gala dinner and auction where uh, we'll be auctioning off uh, some of Grant's artwork, but also several other things. We have a silent auction component and a live auction component where uh, John Montgomery, who was an Olympic gold medalist, is going to be our auctioneer. Fantastic. So we're really excited to have him there and, and just raise money for our cause. All right. All the tickets and everything you need is on our website, ctvedmonton.ca. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thank you. We're back right after the break.